it's Lisa and welcome to my channel. Today I am going to be doing a rewind spread for you guys for the week of July 9th through July 15th. And I know I haven't done a B6 spread here in a while, but I am going to be changing that. I am going to get back into it, y'all. I love doing these and I stopped doing them for a minute because I didn't feel like people were watching them, but that's okay. Uh, I do realize that everything is not for everybody but just in case there are some of you on my channel that like my b6 spreads and like to watch my videos of me doing b6 spreads i'm going to start back doing them so with all of that being said guys <laughs> i am using this kit right here from soda pop studio i thought this was so cute and i just love it so yeah, we are going to just jump right into it, guys. We are going to start by placing this bottom washi. I'm not going to cut this or put any Simply Gilded washi in here because I think this is really, really cute and um, I don't think it needs anything at the bottom of this. So I'm just going to place it down. There we go. And then on this side... I'm gonna have to cut it so what I have learned by using these inserts are they the stickers stick to the paper really really bad on these things so I'm gonna take this little plastic ruler here and I'm just gonna place this on here I used to watch Andrea do this and I will always wonder why she would do that but since I have been using these inserts I know why <laughs> because anything that sticks to this paper it sticks to the paper and it rips the paper as soon as you pull it off so we are going to do that now I told you guys I am having a hard time using this little tool right here but there let's see how that came out oh I did good did good all right so we're just going to take that off and place that back on the paper all right so we're heading off to a good start guys so next I'm going to place down these glitter headers I did pick these out of my stash and I chose the green ones just because <laughs> I want to go ahead and use these up and I thought about putting some glitter overlays on these because this spread uh, this paper is really really matte so I don't know you know what let me see let me first let me see let me put down these date covers because sometimes in these particular inserts you never know if the date covers are going to fit so let me place those down first. And these date covers are from Simply Watercolor Co, y'all. And the uh, date numbers are from Rose Color Day. So I'm going to go ahead and place these down first.
right, now that we have those done, I can go ahead and start placing down the full boxes. And for sure, I know I want the girl to go in the middle. She is too cute, y'all, in her little two-piece bathing suit. So, yeah, let's just place her down in the middle right here. So, y'all, I have been noticing that some of the ladies that use um, or use regular TNs, like the ones with the strings, they are now moving over to the three ring. Uh-oh. Hold on one second, guys. <laughs> okay. Yeah, I've been noticing that a lot of the ladies are moving into the ring bound system. And I'm like, eh, that's not for me. I have never liked... <laughs> Three, three ring binders. Even when I was in school, I have never liked three ring binders. So I'm like, I know for a fact that I won't be joining on that little uh, craze right there. So <laughs> that is not for me. So let's take the bag. And I'm just going to be placing these boxes down, not in a row, but kind of in a little um, pyramid type of situation here and I'm just taking this pink one here and then I'll take the one with the shade and let's let me see let's take that one and place it kind of like right there but I don't want it to be too too much too close to that one so let's just move it up a little bit there we go that's better and then let's take another pink one and let's just place it Here. so yeah like I was saying earlier I am really wanting to get back into doing my B6 spreads because I miss doing them on camera and I miss you know having my little videos go up so I'm excited about, about getting this done There we go I think it looks a little weird with this being the only beige box so what I am going to do is I'm gonna switch this box and then I'm gonna take this the last teal box and replace this one so let me do that real quick okay I am back and that looks a little bit more balanced so we can now proceed to Monday. Now guys, I do have my notes over to the side, so I am not <laughs> doing this by memory. Uh, I kept my notes because I knew I wanted to start back uh, doing my B6 spreads. So. But I am going to start by placing down a Coffee Monday sticker, just because she has it in here and it is really, really cute. And I want to use as many of her uh, functional stickles as I can because she has a bunch and they are nice stickers. So even though I think this was my last package of that coffee that I had, I got from Jesse's cousin. So I do want to start with that coffee Monday there. And then on Monday... I planned in my B6 spread. I did this spread right here, which was the 4th of July. And I think this turned out really, really cute, y'all. <laughs> Just to give y'all a little peek. But I did do a B6 spread. And she does. She has a planner here. But 
I think I want to add in some foil. So I'm gonna take one of my little uh, planners from Planning Worlds just to add a little foiling in there. So I was trying to decide which color I wanted to go with because there are several colors that I could choose from to go in this spread. But it seems like it's going to be a pink and blue kind of a day. <laughs> so let's just go with the pink one here. Let's take this pink one and I'll take a blue box. Let's start with a blue box to mark that because I don't think I marked this in my Erin Condren. So let's take that and take our little T in like so. That's cute, 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 cute. And I got a piece of Happy Mail that I want to mark. And since I already have these out, I might as well use these. So let's take the envelope. Cause, because I got some Happy Mail from the 1407 Planners, guys. I picked up some new inserts that I am going to be sharing with you guys soon. But I don't have enough to make a haul yet. So let's see if I let's take this pink little quarter box here to mark that. And then I'll just place the envelope over here. Should I do it? I'll just put it over here since we don't want it to look too cluttered there. And then the last thing I want to mark on Monday is that I washed my delicates. So, ooh, her laundry day sticker is pretty big. So, um, I was trying to see if she had a little basket or something on here that, that was smaller than this little laundry day sticker, but she does not. So. I am going to get a basket. Let me get a basket real quick, y'all. So I'm going to take one of these little baskets from Clever Girl Crafts. This is the Millie colorway on the domestic duties sheet. And I'm just going to place the little basket right here. To note down that I did delicates on Monday as well. And we can now move on to Tuesday. Tuesday, I did a Target run. And let's see if she has something for shopping. No, I don't see anything. <laughs> oh my gosh. I thought I was going to be using her icons, but... I don't know. I don't see anything for shopping. So let me get some. Oh, look, y'all. Here was a basket right here. I overlooked it. Did y'all see that? <laughs> Anyhow, <laughs> we got us a gold foil on there, so it doesn't matter. Let's get a Target Run sticker. Okay, guys. Let me zoom you guys in a little bit. I forgot all about that. So let's zoom you in. That way you guys can get a closer look and then we can go ahead and place our Target sticker down. So she doesn't have a lot of quarter boxes in this uh, kit, y'all, because it's a mini kit. So I'm going to be bringing in some. And I picked these from Tassel Planner. They were a freebie that I got with purchase. But I'm not seeing anything i think the pink is a good match but the teal and the greens are not so i did bring out some more i think this blue shade is a good match these are glitter uh quarter boxes from um little miss papery 
so there are not too many colors I can bring in but I also brought in this color palette so you know what I think I'm going to do I think I'm going to take this little beige color right here a goldish color we can start with that one that's because I don't want to have too much pink and green or teal and pink you know I want to you know bring in some different colors here so and then I have a gold uh, Target sticker from Magic Prince Co but now that I'm looking at that let's change it <laughs> okay let's take one of these colorful ones from lovely plant and let's take let's take this pink shade right here and we'll just place that in the middle for our target run there we go and on Tuesday Tuesday was not a very busy day so she has this uh, me time sticker I'm just gonna take this me time sticker and I want to put it behind some washi now the only washi that I brought out for this spread is this blue shade right here because I thought it was it would work well but I probably should have brought out some pink too so but for now this is what we're working with so let's just place that down do you do you guys ever go through your simply yielded washi like I just did a spread earlier and it had yellow in it and I really wanted to use some of my Simply Gilded Washi, but I was using gold in the spread and all of my Simply Gilded Washi that is yellow is either silver or it's that holographic, no, not, is it holographic foil? Anyhow, it's all silver. So I was like, oh. When you need a Simply Yielded Washi to be yellow and gold, it's yellow and silver. When you need it to be blue and silver, it's blue and gold. You know what I mean? So it's like, ugh, why? Why does she not give choices? Make some yellow and gold washi, please, Irene. I know she's not watching my channel, but <laughs> I wish she would do that you know, offer different options for foiling. Because I would definitely get a yellow and go for sure. See, it's not cutting, y'all. Okay, so I got that cut. And let's put our me time sticker down because I had a little me time. There we go. All right, guys, we are going to move on to Wednesday. It was hump day. So I am going to be taking a hump day sticker, guys, and we can use, oh, I don't have very many of these left, do I? So let's use the pink one right here. And let's just place it down right here in the middle because it was hump day. There we go. And guys, we are going to thug these plants up this week, which I have not done in a while. But Wednesday was not a very busy day, so we're going to thug these plants up. But before we do that, let's kind of divide up the little space right there. So to do that, we are going to take one of these bow headers from not headers but bow dividers from um simply watercolor co and let's just put that there all right guys we are gonna thug these plans up and we're gonna take our uh today scenes kind of art sticker from shameless stickers and we are just going to place that right here like so because like I said Wednesday was not a very busy day 
And the last thing I want to put on Wednesday is that I did do my walk, my 45 minute walk. Now she does have a exercise shoe here. So I am going to be using that and I'm going to take that and put that on a little quarter box. Let's take the pink one that um, came on the tasseled planner sampler. And then I'm just going to take the shoe and place it over the bow for walking on Wednesday. And we can now move on to Thursday. So on Thursday, I filmed a video and for that I'm going to take a half box. And I'm not going to take this half box. <laughs> I'm going to take this half box and I'm going to place that down for filming a video. And I am going to take one of my little girls here from Sicker Fever Shop holding the camera. And I'm going to take this orange one right here because I think she matches pretty good and I'm just gonna place her there for filming guys and then I'm gonna take a gold film script from um, Magic Prince Call in there to give the box a little foil so let's just put our film script in there so there we go that's cute 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 and then the only other thing I'm gonna mark on um, Thursday is that I had a little bath and I relaxed and I read quite a bit on Thursday so that's the only thing I'm gonna mark because like I said these uh, in I use these inserts for just you know things that I don't get to mark in my Aaron Condren, if I'm just going to take this bath girl here from Fox and Cactus, and I think I'm gonna take one of my little um boxes from Little Miss Papery, and let's take this one right here. And I'll just put my little bath girl in there. Like so. Let's put her down there. Here because we have the girl here in the corner. So, And let's go ahead and move our little divider up a little bit. Okay. Now moving on to Friday. Friday was payday. And she has a cute little payday sticker here. But the first thing I wanna I wanna put down this weekend banner because it's cute and I like it. I wanna use it so I hate to waste weekend banners. I know a lot of people don't use weekend banners, but I'm like the weekend banners are so cute they make the weekend my goodness so i like to use it but like i said it was payday and i am going to take her payday sticker and let's put it here do i want to put something in between that because it kind of matches the weekend banner so you know what let's just bring it down here let's put some washi behind it just to judge it up a little bit. Give it a little something, something. Something, 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 something just ain't right. I used to love that song. <laughs> I 
All right, now we can place down our payday sticker. Like so, there we go. And then I also want to mark on Friday is that I did have a bill due. So for the bill due, we can go ahead and place that up at the top. Let's take this color right here because we haven't been using that color a lot. And I like it. It's orange. And how often do we get to use orange? But I'm sure, pretty sure in the fall, we are going to be seeing a bunch of orange. <laughs> it's funny how the colors, how colors come around during different seasons. I, I've been noticing that a lot lately. And I'm pretty sure I'm going to be using rose gold a lot late. I mean, in the fall because... That's crooked, y'all. Let me straighten that out. Because a lot of the kits that I have been purchasing for fall, they have rose gold. So, it'll be rose gold in the fall, gold in for Christmas and all that stuff. But, yeah. Moving on. I want to put down that I had tacos for dinner that night. That is the night that I drove across town to get some street tacos y'all those are the best tacos that i have tasted as for street tacos so let's take one of our little miss papery quarter boxes and i think i want to take this little gold one right y'all To mark down that we had street tacos that day. There we go. And we can now move on to Saturday. On Saturday, I did sleep in that day as far as our can remember but sleeping sleeping in for me is just just means not getting out of the bed <laughs> it doesn't mean anything other than that and she doesn't have a sleep in sticker which is understandable so i'm just gonna start with just clean all the things because i did clean and i changed sheets and all of that good stuff so let's just place that there. And I also want to put down that my daughter and I, yeah, we watched Harry Potter all day. Well, all weekend actually, because they were having a marathon, a Harry Potter marathon on sci-fi. They now have Harry Potter on sci-fi channel. So we watched Harry Potter all weekend long and I want to mark that down and Harry Potter's birthday is coming up soon it's actually on Tuesday I believe and they are going to be doing that same marathon again <laughs> so I'll be at work so I won't be able to watch it all day but I will probably catch it at the end of the day so I was just going to say she had a little TV here, but I think I'm gonna I'm going to put a foil TV there because oh man if I I don't think I don't know if I have my gold foil televisions because I don't know what happened to my televisions y'all I had gold foil televisions and I had rose gold and I had silver and for whatever reason. Yeah, I don't have my foil ones. What For whatever reason, I lost my gold ones and my silver ones. I was like, what happened to my uh, stickers? I have no idea what happened to my stickers, y'all. So let's see if I can find a foiled one somewhere else. So I'm taking out my icons sheets and to see if I have a gold for a television somewhere i probably don't i probably used them all up now oh, that's silver uh, is that gold 
I think that's rose gold. And that's pink. Uh, nope, I don't have one. So you know what? We are going to just take one of our regular televisions. And that's going to be that. <laughs> I don't even have anything to mark for Harry Potter. Which is okay because as much as I love Harry Potter, I'm not that into Harry Potter like some of the other ladies are. Because you know what? I'm just too grown for that, y'all. I'm just too grown. <laughs> and I'm saying that, but I'm going to use a Harry Potter get next week. <laughs> That's all right. I don't mind using a kit every now and then, but as far as setting up a tin and all that, and I'm like, no, nah, I'm not finna, I'm not finna do all that, y'all. <laughs> so you know what? See, this is my only four-hour television sheet that I have left. I don't know what happened to my four-hour television sheet. So let's take this girl covered in her blankets, eating popcorn. Because that's pretty much what we did. We just kind of chilled out and watched Harry Potter all day. There we go. And I think that is all I wanted to mark for Saturday in this B6 spread. I'm going to move on to Sunday. I'm going to go back and fill that in later, guys. But for now, I'm just going to leave it like that. But on Sunday, I went and had a pedicure. And my eyebrows arched. So let's take our pedicure stickers. So for having a pedicure, I'm gonna take one of these stickers right here from Hello Petite Paper and I'll take the pink one that says Petiton. And let's just place that here for the pedicure. And I want to mark that I cooked dinner for Jesse. And I hadn't cooked in a long time. Y'all, he has been the one cooking and everything on Sundays. So <laughs> for me to cook, it's like, uh which I do cook for him. I cook for breakfast for him and everything. And he'll cook dinner. So we kind of even it out. But that day I, I did cook dinner. So I'm going to place a divider, a bow divider. Let's just place it down here in the center. And then I'm going to take... I think it's the last half box, right? Yes, it is. I'm just gonna take that and put it here. And then I'll take this cooking girl from Happy Day of Stickers, y'all. And I'll just place her here for cooking. And then let me go back and get my Lazy Day sticker for the, for Saturday. I mean, not lazy day, sleep in sticker. <laughs> All right, guys, here is a final look at the spread. I think this turned out really, really cute. I went ahead and added in this sleep in sticker from Sweet Bella XO behind some washi. Then I added in the little quarter box down here with the munchkin eating popcorn when watching TV. I have placed the inserts back into the planner. But I think this turned out really, really cute. I love it. I love doing B6 spreads. I think they are so much fun. And I am so glad I filmed this for you all. I hope you guys enjoy the video. And as always, guys, I hope you are having a great day and or a great week whenever you are viewing this video. And I will talk to you guys in the next 
Bye.